What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Planet Nomads. This is not Planet Nomads. This is Subnautica. What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Subnautica. So last episode, we started building this super amazing little base place. We got some melons. We got some, what are these, Chinese potatoes? Chinese potatoes. Oh, they're 100% now. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, but these are going to be our main source of food. Uh, and I ate a couple of things that I shouldn't have eaten. So, yeah, it happens. Anyways, let's start off by listening to this message. It's probably super important. Oh, it is high priority automated message. Oh. Carrying high priority personnel. Yoki Kasa. I said Kasa. Why do I have to record this anyway? Oh. What? What? It's a, it actually said burial detail. What? <laughs> I thought it said send help. Anyways, what are we doing? Well, I'm glad you asked because we are going to go ahead. We're going to make ourselves a, where's it at? A uh, mobile vehicle bay. So that way we can make the Seamoth. Oh, yes, indeed. So we need some lubricants, some power cells. <gasps> Easy enough. Not even an issue whatsoever. But if you guys are enjoying the series, enjoying the episode, don't forget to leave a like if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Now, I think we can take these. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, we take those. We can turn them in to some lubricant. And I think we needed, what, two lubricant, if I'm not mistaken? But um, yes, thank you guys for the support. I do appreciate it. You guys are absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, we're actually getting close to the point. I don't think this one, this one, no. This one's going to come out beforehand. But we are getting to the point where I'm going to have to have some pre-recorded videos because we're going to PAX. I know, it's amazing. And we're actually going to be live streaming from PAX, right? Who's excited? I am super excited. All right, so we have all that. Uh, but we're going to be live streaming Astroneer from PAX over on YouTube. So make sure you are subscribed if you want to see that. It's pretty amazing, pretty cool. We might have a special guest. I can't say anything more. We have uh, the stuff. Uh, we need a power cell. Power cell is two batteries because it's it's two batteries. So two batteries in silicon rubber, uh, acid mushrooms, copper ore, uh, acid mushrooms, silicone, copper ore. Okay. Uh, do we have silicone? I don't know if we have any more silicone. We might have to make some more. Do we have any silicone? Nope. Oh, but we do have two batteries actually. Ooh, oh, hold on. Actually, let's see, can I make? <gasps> oh, wait, this makes two? One seed cluster makes two silicone? No way. No way, that's amazing. One power cell coming on up. I like it. So we used our power cells that were like half depleted, right? Absolutely. Uh, and then we're gonna, <gasps> we don't need anything else. We got it. We did it, we, uh, is it, it's a deployable, right? It is a deplorable. All right, let's get that guy printed up. Fantastic, gonna take a whole bunch of power, that's fine. And then, oh my gosh, guys, we're going to get a Seamoth this episode. Who's excited? I'm super excited. Okay, so we have that guy. Let's go ahead and get you placed like right over here in this vehicular printing place area that we're going to make a vehicular printing place thing right there. Fantastic. All right. So we need a Seamoth. What do we need for the Seamoth, you ask? Well, we are going to need titanium ingot, power cell, glass, lubricant, lead. We have lubricant, we have lead. So we need two glass, a power cell, and titanium ingot. I think I already have a titanium ingot. Didn't I make one by accident? I must have used it on something. What did I use it on? Hmm, I don't remember using it on it. What did I use a titanium ingot on? Man, I have no idea. Anyways, we're gonna continue on. Okay, so easy enough. I really wish I could pin this, you know? <laughs> I need to be able to pin it because I have a goldfish memory. Glass, power cell, titanium ingot. That sounds super easy, and I think we are gonna be able to do that, no problemo. Mmm, copper, copper. Acid mushroom, acid mushroom. Wait, hold on, hold on. Was there another acid mushroom here? Nope, that was a bladder fish. Okay. So we need a bunch of titanium and a um one of those. That'll work for that. And I already forgot what we need except for titanium. Wow, I'm terrible at this. Oh, glass, we need glass. Okay, I knew that. I knew we needed glass. Just kidding, I knew that. Oh my gosh, we have another message, people. What does this message this say? Avery Quinn. Avery Quinn. Aurora <gasps> D. Reed. Over. Yes. Nothing but vacuum. Also, this is Neebs Gaming, shit. just so you guys know. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Of course not. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. Yes. Yep, I'll sure do. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's gonna have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. <laughs> See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime. It's not gonna pick up anything because we're not there. We are getting so much closer. 
glass titanium make it easy enough uh you know what i'm just going out i'm gonna go grab the stuff i'll see you when we get back so quick tip for all you guys out there and gals if you are looking for quartz nighttime it, oh we need to make the rebreather nighttime is a fantastic time for quartz because it is like it's almost bioluminescent it's like super bright compared to everything else so it's usually pretty easy to find within the thickets of the grass you could also probably turn down the uh like the the graphical settings and i bet you that grass would probably clear out pretty quick <laughs> oh hey we're down here <gasps> cool i found quartz the quartz led me down here we probably shouldn't be down here that's okay yeah probably not mm. oh more quartz hold on we need the quartz though <gasps> oh and salt that'll give us some water oh we're gonna get all the quartz let's not die though that'd be fantastic i don't want to not trying to get eaten right now if you guys know what i'm saying there's some things down here that like to eat our faces off. Ooh, my oxygen is getting low. Let's get out of here. Okay. Um, also, I need some copper. This is not copper. That's not going to give us copper. Oh, more salt. Oh, my gosh. I want all the things. Holy cave entrance. Talk about a good entrance. Wow. Has that always been like that? Man. I really got to pay attention to, like, the surroundings a little bit more and really appreciate the views because that looks really nice. I like that. Okay. Grab these. Um, I'm not going to have a lot of inventory space. I'm going to have to come out and get the titanium afterwards. But we're gonna need all this gold and silver and whatnot anyways oh we really need that rebreather too all right we made it back safely no worries absolutely no worries so we're gonna make, go ahead and make two glass and then we're gonna throw everything in the uh the storage over here for later because look at all my gosh holy moly that was a good little run there oh yes indeed it was okay so let's throw the titanium in there throw that we'll throw the gold we'll throw the silver look at that Ooh. Should we make the rebreather? What do we need for a rebreather? Wiring kit fiber mesh. Easy enough. We already have the silver, so the wiring kit's not a deal. Let's go over here and we'll get some creep vine stuff to make some fiber mesh. And then we really need to. We gotta get some titanium. Like we really need some titanium. So let's grab a few of these guys. Okay, I think that'll be enough. Let's go back here. Let's craft it up. Get ourselves a rebreather and be able to breathe. Re, re breathe Lee ish and we have a rebreather let's go ahead and swap that out we're gonna keep the radiation helmet with us just in case i know it's gonna take up some inventory spaces but it'll be just fine it'll be fine but now we need some titanium and then we should be able to build ourselves a fancy new sea moth oh oh there's already radiation detected oh that's not good okay hold on a second what is okay i need a laser cutter what does a laser cutter require us, do we even have the laser cutter i don't even think that's a thing for us yet is it laser cutter no it's not Ooh, radiation's already leaking over here we're gonna have to go fix that thing <gasps> that's not good we're completely full of titanium well we're full of scrap i gotta go refine it into titanium however i'm also trying to keep a lookout for like scannable items and like the boxes with the scannable things because i really need that laser cutter and i'm not sure where i found the other two pieces of it so I should have looked around, should have looked around a little bit more and probably have found the rest of that thing, but that's okay. We'll be fine. And one titanium ingot coming on up. Okay. So do we have everything in our inventories to build the sea moth? No, we're missing the lead. Okay. I need the lead. Where's the lead? Give me the lead. <gasps> lead. All right. Good. Now I think we should. <gasps> oh, we're good. We are so good. We're totally going to build this guy. Come on. Let's do it. Me and you, uh, George, 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 and Steve, if I'm not mistaken. I think those are the robot names that we named the first playthrough. Vehicles, Seamoth. <gasps> yes! But remember that swimming is good for your glutes and <laughs> Give me a Seamoth! Splash! Oh, we're so happy. Look at it in all its glory. Let's go ahead and hop in. <gasps> Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome. Well, thank you. Oh, it feels so good to have you back in my life, Seamoth. Oh, that's amazing. Wouldn't it be cool if they made like an actual submarine that like looked like this little teeny tiny guy? Oh, it's so cute. You know, it's actually not that teeny tiny. I did play this game in VR once and this thing is actually quite huge. That's the advantage of playing stuff in VR is that you realize how large things are. Like Slime Rancher, those slimes are absolutely massive. We have another message. Gosh, people are blowing up our phones here. Okay, so we got another distress signal. This is Officer Keen in Light Pod 19. Officer Keen. The captain is gone. Okay. I have assumed command. 
The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. Dry land. We regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Got it. Stay together and good luck. Okay. This message will now repeat. Wonderful. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Uh oh. Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. Oh. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Alrighty. Fantastic. Wait, which way is southwest? Oh, that's right. We don't have the compass yet. Okay. So, uh, we need the laser cutter. And for that, we need diamond. Now, I don't... I don't remember where diamond's at on this. And I also don't remember where the... Wait, do we even need diamond on this? I thought we did. Almost positive we did. Mm, okay. We're going to go out. We're going to go on a little bit of a search here and see if we can't find... Life Rod 3, Shallows, or Sea Glide damage. Was this the one? This is the one. This is the one with the encounter with the Reaper Leviathan. Because it gets you closer than you've ever been before. <gasps> it's terrifying. I think, right? I think it... I think it, you know, I don't really know, actually. It might not be. All right, so I'm going to search around. I'm going to see if I can't find this last laser cutter deal. Did I already go through this area or did I not? Mm, yeah, I think I already went through this. Okay, continuing on. Wait, here's Life Pod 3. Is this the one we already checked out? No, there's a PDA right there. Let's go check it out, shall we? What are we going to get? Ooh, are we going to get something good? <gasps> the compass! <laughs> hey. We got the compass that we kind of needed. Okay, cool. Uh, anything good? What is this? Sea glide fragment? Don't need it. Looking for laser cutter fragments so we can do laser cuttery things and go and explore the Aurora. But I don't want to. I don't want to go without laser cutter because you need a laser cutter to like get everything in the Aurora at one time. Oh well, now see this isn't a good sign because there's these what bone sharks? I think they're called bone sharks. Uh, I hate these bone sharks because they kind of lead to like. Hey! 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 No snacking. No snacking on the sea moth, okay? I don't want to have to fix it already. We just got the thing. I don't think it's over here, guys. I don't think the laser cutter's on this side. I think we're going to go the other way. Ooh, it's a little sketchy through here. That is a mobile vehicle bay fragment, I think. Pretty sure that's a mobile vehicle bay fragment. Let's check it. Make sure. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Don't need it. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. What's, what's this? Is that... Yes, that's exactly what we needed. That was perfect. Oh, we got it. Okay, so I got to see what we need for it. Now, we're also right next to that guy. Ooh, 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 a fancy wreck. Wrong button. Okay, so we need a laser cutter. Yeah, we need two diamond. Okay, so the diamond is in the deeper area. I don't recall the easiest way to get to that area off the top of my head. I can't really remember... But I know there's useful stuff in here. So we're gonna hop in, uh, radiation detected. Maybe we should, we really need to go work on that radiation. Yeah, that's probably kind of a big deal. Uh, we have the radiation suit though, so we could throw that guy on. I'm trying to think where Diamond was. It might be, you know what, let's just swap the radiation suit on. Okay, I, I will do just that. I don't have any, so you're gonna have to wait. <laughs> you have to, body, you're gonna have to wait. Where is, oh, here's life pod six. Hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh, that stupid sh sh sand shark scared me. I thought it was, I thought it was time. I thought we were going to meet the uh, unfortunate Leviathan of the Reaper. Oh, I don't like these big open waters like that. It's scary. Okay, let's go over here. Yeah, I know oxygen efficiency is decreased, but I don't have a choice. Lead. What else do we got? PDA. Okay. Not really worried about those flares or anything. All right, we're gonna have to go and try to find ourselves some. You know what? We gotta check this. Uh, I don't really have enough food and water. Yeah, we gotta go back. We're gonna have to go find diamonds so we can get our laser cutter and prepare ourselves for the Aurora. We're gonna have to do that. All right, so we're here for the food and the water. Do, are our melons done yet? <gasps> yes, they are. Oh, wonderful. Okay, let's go ahead. Consume, consume, consume. Wow, that is, actually doesn't help us a whole lot, does it? Let's go ahead and let's get some seeds out of these guys. Come on, let's uh, seed. There we go. Come on. Come on, seeds. Okay, there's there's a sweet spot. The hitbox is very small on these. There we go. Okay, perfect. Use planter. And we'll go ahead and switch container on all of these bad boys. Look at that. Perfect. And then we'll go ahead and we'll just grab some, uh, we'll grab some water. Food is good. So we'll grab two things of water. We will consume those delicious water. Actually, we'll just consume one. And let's go ahead and store some of this titanium as well. All right, titanium cave sulfur is good to go. Actually, hold on. I don't need you and I don't need you. Okay. 
So we we need to find diamond. Where is diamond at? It might be in that cave with the worm deals. Ooh, hold on. Before we do anything, let's get this guy repaired up here. All right, good as new. Wonderful. All right, so where was that life pod? I think the life pods go away after so long. Beacon manager, uh, sea moth near your cave under attack. That's the one we want. Okay, and let's go ahead and color that one this color. All right, so where are you? You're this way. Wonderful. We're going to go over here. We're going to hop down in that cave. Um, try to find diamond. I don't know if diamond's in that cave, but there is lithium. And lithium will be handy for reinforcing our bases. Places. All right, so we're going to go in here. I hit a fish and my thing went down to 94%. Are you serious? We're going to go down into here. I'm going to have to put my uh, my rebreather. God, I hate those things. They're so like freaky. Are you, who's is anybody here like, you know, like not like snakes? I'm not saying like I'm scared to death of them. What are you doing, guys? Go away. Go away, you stupid things. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, that's that's our maximum death. Let's get up here and let's okay. Let's swap out our mask and see if we start taking any damage right away. It seems like we're good. All right, we're going to go and we're going to look for all this stuff. I'm going to try to find diamond along the way. I think it's usually in these darker rocks right here. Okay, that's lithium. That'll work. I'm good with lithium. We need some diamond though. We need two diamond actually. Hey, we got one diamond. Yes, I'm aware. Everything I gather is your property. Meh, meh, meh. These guys are just worried about their money. Okay, let's go. Let's go in here. What we got? Okay, we got a health kit. Uh, anything good? Anything good? Okay, so there's I there's a PDA here somewhere. I know there is. There's like always a PDA laying around these things. No? Alright. Uh let's go get some oxygen. Oh my gosh. Stupid seal. Stupid stupid deal. I don't like you. Go away. Alright, we got one. <laughs> We've got one diamond so far. Ooh, there's a base right there too. Okay, we're gonna go check that guy out. Oh gosh, there's that. There's one of those stupid, stupid eels. Oh, I hate you. He's like, he's guarding it. You see that? It's like guarding it. It's like, whoop. And then he goes hiding his hole. Oh, I hate those. I hate those things so much. Okay, we're gonna try to find, I just, I need one more diamond. That's really all I need down here. And then I would completely leave and never worry about coming back. Okay, let's quick, 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 quick. PDA. Location uploaded to PDA. Okay. Wonderful. I don't know if there's diamond down here. Diamond, diamond, diamond. Please be diamond. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. All right. Uh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. All right. I'm not. Oh, I hate those things. We're not going to play down here. I don't like playing with these guys. It's a bad, bad part of town right here. <laughs> it only gets worse from here, too, is the worst part. Like, this isn't even that bad. Where's my sea moth? There it is. Okay. All right, perfect. Let's go back and let's build ourselves a laser cutter. And we're safely back at home. Okay, so we should have the stuff we need. I know, okay, a little bit of lag here. That's fine. I know I'm going to need something out of, okay, so we need a battery and titanium and cave sulfur. Okay, that should be easy enough. It is gonna be copper. And what was the other thing? What is, oh, acid mushrooms, okay. Uh, titanium, cave sulfur. I don't think I have a battery. Do I have a battery? Mm, I don't have one. Okay, let's grab let's grab some of these this, these little mushroom deals here. Perfect. Okay, so since we're about to build a battery or build something with a battery, we're gonna go ahead and swap this guy out first, and then go back over here and go to this guy. Personal. What was I building? Equipment. That's right. We're building the laser cutter. <gasps> Wonderful. So we have a laser cutter. We have a repair tool, and oh, are we gonna get the little zappy deal? Wait, are we gonna touch the end? Oh, you know what? I think that was on this thing. The first time you pull this out, you touch it with your finger and then it shocks you. It's kind of it's kind of funny. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, okay, so we have the repair. We have a sea glide. We have a cutty tool. What else we're gonna need for our, our journeys over there? We're gonna need the radiation helmet. Absolutely 100%. Uh, we're gonna need some food and water. Actually, you know, we're not because spoilers. There's actually food and water like in the place. So <gasps> look at all of those melons grow. Wonderful. All right, uh, another man. We are popular people here. Aurora, this is Sunday. Oh, here we go. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. I didn't know how bad, how many of you, I, I didn't know. We're now en route to your location. We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. What else can I say? <laughs> the only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. 
and I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. <laughs> Oh, it's so funny. The classic of leaving the, uh, leaving your microphone on when you're not supposed to. Um, okay. So we're good there. I think we are like pretty much good to go. Food and water is the only thing I'm worried about. So we'll take, we'll drink that. We'll take that. We'll take that. And I could go out and get some food. I think we're going to have everything we need and we're going to get so much stuff in our inventory. It's going to be kind of amazing. So we're probably actually, you know what we're going to do? That's the wrong button. Come on. We're going to leave this. No, we're not. We're going to take our radiation helmet with us, but we're going to leave the re We got another message. Holy moly. All right. Well, let's listen to this one too. Oh. Uh oh. Do not attempt retrieval without submersible support. Guess what? We have submersible support. <laughs> it's amazing. Uh, okay, so we're good on those. We're good on that. I could take these potatoes with us. I don't know how long those are actually going to last, though. I would rather take some of these melons with us. Well, there's food there. Hmm. <laughs> All righty. You know what? I think we're going to go ahead. I think we're going to end this episode here, guys. Uh, we got the sea moth. It's amazing. We got things ready. We're ready to go. Next episode, we're going to go to the Aurora. We're going to check it out. We're going to do the things. We're going to fix the stuff and get a whole bunch of goodies i cannot wait so hopefully you guys want to stick around hang out have a good time Welcome but if you enjoyed this episode don't forget to leave a like if you're new here don't forget to subscribe as well for some more and i will see you in the next episode of subnautica